Hi, this is me, Megan. And this is me, Anna. And we are currently in the North Island of New Zealand, exploring active volcanoes, stunning walks, and rich Māori history. We will also be doing unique experiences like getting dizzy in a bull, shaving 10 years off our age at the mud pools, then seeing the world from a small perspective like a hobbit. Good morning everybody! Today's a very exciting day, but first just sniff. Can you smell that? That's the smell of the beach. Yes, we are at the beach. We are at a beautiful little place called Mount Monganui. As you can see, the beautiful golden sand behind me here. Uh, this is about an hour drive from Rotorua, and now we are going to go to the top of the mount where you get these amazing views. So, just got to the start of the track, and it says it's 1,260 meters high, and it should take us about an hour to get to the summit. Although, it's already a very steep climb. Right, so today we started the day with those two people here telling me that we're going to do a nice little walk around a mountain. And when I get here, 1,200 kilometers up. Kilometers, meters, meters, kilometers then. <laughs> meters up, which is a lot for me. We've just found some friends on the track, they're so cute. Look at them, sheepies. First time in Mount Munganui and this like walk that we're doing now was the most recommended thing for us to do. Look at these views behind us already like you can see the whole entire coastline it's just beautiful but I am excited to see what else Mount Munganui has to offer also. We did have a wee coffee this morning but there's hot pools, there's more walks, heaps of trendy cafes and restaurants as well but this walk <laughs> so nice and it's so nice to be in like the sea breeze Sweaty, real sweaty. Here you go. Hey. So today we decided to do this walk here in Mount Munganui. Who suggested was Megan's dad, but apparently he's been here before, and that is a much easier one that you can do around the mountain. However, today we want to go to the summit. It's still not as steep, but there's a lot of um, steps. So if you don't like them, that may be not a good idea, but. You can have those amazing views all the way across, so I think it's very worth it. color of that water so blue and the sand is so golden I think we're getting close though because a little bit around the corner one guy said it was only five minutes away 
we're on the home stretch now five more minutes i feel like i'm you know running in the race to the finish line anna and my dad are at the back i'm gonna get the gold medal we made it we made it guys look at this view that's what makes me walk this time and be happy look at that So here you can see basically where Mount Monganui sticks out. So you've got the two beaches that run either side here. And this just gives you like such a clear understanding of where Mount Monganui is on the map in New Zealand as well. But check out these views. Perfect day. I'm definitely gonna get sunburnt today. <laughs> leaving the top now and making our way back down to the bottom and we're going to find out what else beautiful Mount Monganui has to offer. There is a success isn't it Tim? Of course. Go team! Yay! Yay. <laughs> we made it to the top and to the bottom. <laughs> Everyone <laughs> <laughs> After that big walk, the nice big ice cream was well deserved. Mm. Pookie pookie. Mmm. a lot of nice place you can eat along the beach over here. I've got some yummy onion rings and some chips for us as well. Yum. And of course I could not come to the beach without putting even my feet on the water you know today has been more than like 23 or 4 degrees it's boiling hot and it's gonna be my first time in a New Zealand sea so hope it's not too cold Portion of chips wasn't enough, so we decided to get even more. <laughs> 